as chair of the FAO Commission on Genetic Resources for Food and Agriculture, I am honored to join the celebration of this year's International Day for Biological Diversity. This year, the theme is Be Part of the Plan, and the Commission on Genetic Resources is part of that plan. With 179 countries and the European Union as its members, the Commission works to conserve all biodiversity important to food and agriculture and to make sure they are used sustainably. Conserving biodiversity and more specifically genetic resources for food and agriculture is a task for all of us. Seeds, germplasm, and other genetic materials feed into the rich agricultural diversity we see across the globe, and they are key to helping us adapt to a changing world. There is not one country that does not depend on food from other countries. We depend on each other. We need each other. And if we hope to tackle global food security, the climate crisis, and other threats to our food systems, we need to work together to protect the biodiversity that our food systems depend on. For more than 40 years, the Commission has been tracking the state of the world's genetic resources for food and agriculture and developed global action plans to help protect them. In 2021, we created the framework for action on biodiversity for food and agriculture, which will help guide and unite global efforts to conserve biodiversity important to food in agriculture. This framework for action and the Kunming Montreal Global Biodiversity Framework complement each other. The implementation of one supports the implementation of the other. Together, these efforts will help address the key drivers of biodiversity loss and accelerate our efforts to safeguard biodiversity for food and agriculture. 